Yo, what's up you guys? Welcome back to another video. My name is Samuele Nocentini and uh, today we're heading downtown. I'm meeting with a friend, Alex, and uh, we're going to see the new film John Wick. So that should be pretty cool. But uh, after that, we're going to a car meet in Mayfair. And uh, I just got the car all nice and clean. So what do you guys think? With it? And the lowering springs. Doing pretty good. So I'm already running late and uh, we need to get going here. So let's hear a startup here. <laughs> Sounds pretty good. Okay, we'll get going and uh, we'll meet with Alex pretty shortly. Okay. What's up, my man? Hey, nice <laughs> How's it going, man? Good, man. How you doing, bro? <coughs> Very good. good to see you, man. Good to see you, too. Awesome. It's awesome. So, guys, uh, this is my friend uh, Alex. Hey, guys. And, uh, yeah, he rocks fitness, man. Tell, tell them what you do, man. Oh, man, yeah, yeah. I'm, uh, I'm a commercial sales manager for Flyman Fitness Victoria. Yep. Um, what's really cool about our company, we're actually owned by a charity and two-thirds of our profits actually goes back to charity, so um, specifically children's charity. So just know if you guys support us, if you purchase any sort of fitness equipment or accessories, literally two-thirds of it, all the profits are going back to uh, people that need it. So yeah, it's awesome. Come check us out. We're across from Mayfair Mall, uh, ironically between the KFC and Starbucks. So let me know. Uh, reach out to Sam if you guys need anything locally. So yeah, yeah I'll throw I'll throw his Instagram in the description. But man, we're late. We need to get going. Like a movie, man. <laughs> Watching John Wick three, guys. <laughs> let you know how it goes. Oh, I can't wait. Can't yeah. wait. <laughs> Oh my god, guys. <laughs> that was insane, man. We just finished. That was freaking amazing. Okay. 10 out of 10. <laughs> Holy jeez. Best John Wick yet. Oh my god. I would say, like, you know how, like, usually there's, like, when there's, like, series in the movies, like, the first one's always the best? Yeah. Not in this case. Oh, man. It just man. gets better and this, better. this was unbelievable. Yeah. I, ne I never, actual movie, top. Yeah. Holy. And now we're directed to Mayfair. So let's start the baby up here. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, it's got a great nice crowd. Awesome, yeah, what yeah. do you think? That's nice. <laughs> That's nice, dude. <laughs> Woo! Just got here, man. So. Yeah, that was a quick run just from uh, audio movies. Let's see if I can put light on here so you guys. Yeah, yeah right. that's better. Awesome. So yeah, we just uh, got out of uh, audio on there, just downtown Victoria, and uh, we're on the rooftop of uh, Mayfair Mall. Uh, so there should be a car meet up here. I never been at it, but. We'll see if it's a meet or not. Yeah. <laughs> Tell the guys about uh, your old car. Uh, oh man, okay. So this is gonna be a trip down memory lane. So a couple years ago I owned an Infiniti G35 Sport Coupe. It was a 2006, uh, it was a full sport package and it was this fucking beautiful red. It's like this, oh man, it's like a fire truck red almost. But uh, Man, I got a lot of looks. <laughs> but it was not it was not only uh, beautiful to, to look at, it was oh my god, it was just so much fun to drive. So hopefully oh. get it back one day. But so we have some together. cars, eh? It's looking good.
we just met uh, with uh, Matthew here and uh, he's the organizer of uh, this car meet and uh, I just found out today about it on Instagram so yeah we showed up and it's not bad actually there's quite a couple of cars here good turn you were saying yeah huh? yep yeah we got Barry in the house I want to say yeah maybe I can't tell. so this is a 535 so the n54 straight six aka the German 2JZ okay <laughs> got a nice set of rims man yeah it does my daily duty it holds yeah. my family back What's up, Adrian? What up, what up? <laughs> so you said you got kids too, huh? Yep. Yeah? Yeah, I got one. There's a car seat in the back of that car right now. Oh, there you go. It makes me invisible to cops. Besides being a beige <laughs> station wagon, you put a, back, a car seat in the back seat, cops, they just... <laughs> they just don't even think of it. Adrian's doing some noise. Making some loud sounds. <laughs> pop, pop. Wow. No, it's pretty good, man. Thank you. Yeah, well, I love we're it. here. I love it. Box of fries. <laughs> Got beautiful <laughs> NSX here. Chipotle and fucking ketchup. Awesome. There's the baby. <laughs> Obviously the the banner and then. Originally, I had the Subaru logo was red, so it was like red, white, red, right? Yeah. And then... Looks nice, man. Yeah, like eventually, it. I'm probably going to paint the car red. Um, I like it. It's pretty good. Done a fair bit to the engine, because right at three weeks after I bought it, the engine blew, the wastegate oh, uh, so. stuck closed, and That's so bad. just grenaded the engine. <laughs> It's an infinity, I've never seen one like this. Yeah, it's, you know, it's it doesn't look, it has a body kit, that, it, it doesn't look like that stock. So. Okay, it does have a body kit. It okay. does, yeah, so I was the thinking, side yeah. skirts are Admiration Japan, uh, they're pretty rare. The wheels are also discontinued. Yeah. yeah. So those are like, like I, I have a buddy in Japan who I like, a pen pal with about, because like, this car is pretty rare in Japan too. But yeah. if you want to be in Canada as well with these wheels that are also discontinued, like, very yeah. uncommon. So he is like the Japanese guy goes crazy over this thing. Like it's so funny. Well, I'm um, sure it's being imported because right, yeah, it was right imported to like Saskatchewan in 2007, I believe. It was handed through a bunch of people uh, yeah. locally and um, fixed this up. I fixed this up for like less than 700 bucks. I was quoted like 3,500 dollars worth of work. It's a 4.5 liter V8 okay. stock, but it's Japanese spec, so it makes 300 horsepower. 300? Oh. Yeah, 300 horsepower and 300 foot-pounds of torque, like, even across the board. Oh, it smokes. Yeah, it's, it's a four-speed automatic, though, but you can, you can go through the gears. So. So, I don't know if you guys remember, but that was uh, Ben. Actually, I don't think we've seen it in the vlogs before, but uh, he works at the Alfa Romeo dealership and uh, he's got a 1991 NSX. Well, it's pretty cool. Yeah, full 
custom exhaust, uh, all body work, uh, seats. Uh, it's cool. Eh? How was it, Alex? It was dope. It was like my first time in a car meet, so yeah. I'll definitely be back. Yeah. yeah. And uh, yeah, I think we're going to call it the night. We're kind of uh, everybody is starting to leave, and I am waking up at five in the morning tomorrow morning. So. I think that's it for today. But um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and it was nice having Alex in the vlog here. I'll be back. Yeah, he'll be back and uh, we'll see you guys in the next video, okay? Peace.